Once again, and we actually have a chance to tour with including Miyoka and I, I do apologize. Miyoki. Miyoki? Miyoki. Miyoki, okay. <laughs> and we also have Vector here showcasing some of the coolest products that I've ever seen. <laughs> what do you think, Vector? Is that cool? I think these things are awesome. I want one. All right. So with that said, let's take a closer look. All right, and then I have Jerome here. Thank Hello. you so much for having us. That's now, a pleasure. Now, you created these robots, yeah. essentially, right? Yeah. Can you tell us a little bit more about them and the yeah. inspiration? Mm -hmm. Of course. So this is uh, Miroka, and this is Miroki. So here you see oh. Miroka, and Miroka uh, is mounted on the sphere. And there is a reason why we have done that. Because when you have a robot, there is one thing you want to do. You want to <laughs> move it, you know? So you just push it like that, and, and it works. And it oh, oh. And you just push it gently, is that cool? Oh. Yeah. Oh wow, yeah, it's like very sensitive too. Yeah, and, and if you take a look, you, you can see that there is free uh, wheel, that uh, we call this uh, uh, Omni wheel. Oh so yeah. It's moving the ball all the time, depending on the angle of the robot. We call this an Anver Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, so uh, the mechanism is all on the top part of it. Exactly. Yeah, That's and there is also a CPU inside it, nice. uh, which is a NVIDIA Denson, and it's computing all the time, the balance, but also using all the cameras around. There's oh, yeah, it has a variety of different sensors, I see that. Yeah. How many total sensors does this robot have? Um, more than 30. Wow, yeah. incredible. There is 12 mini 3D cameras inside uh, this part, the uh, Ultrasound, uh, yes. 3D cam, uh, and CPU, and then in the cell sensor and everything. Now, is this all autonomous or is somebody controlling it right now? No, it's uh, autonomous, uh, and it, we are using this kind of object. Oh so, wow! <laughs> this, so this is an object that the robot can see perfectly. Um, and this is an object that it can grab. So you can grab it right now. Yeah, you can grab it. So as you can see, you can follow it. Wow. Good team. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, they're and, uh, uh, the small object that you have in here, we, have, we call this a room. Okay, yeah, it's coming from the movie. Yeah, yeah. And this is an object that this robot can well perceive. It could be in your pocket, uh -huh. and then the robot can follow you. Oh, wow. It could be installed on this kind of object. Uh -huh. um, it could be also installed on the ground. So you can like say this is a yeah, oh, kind yeah. of marker. Yeah. So when you press yeah. it, the robot reacts. Oh, wow. yeah? And there is some of them that uh, push the robot, yeah. some of them that trunk the robot. Oh, there is a, a clown yeah. on it, so if you add this here, then the robot will be funny. <laughs> you do that a silent room, and so on. That is incredible. And it's continuously moving, as I can see right here with yeah. the animation, and almost feels life like. And I think yeah. that is uh, the key perspective behind this. Now, including the arms, can you talk more about the arms or how that? Yes, of course. So everything has been designed to be on pedance control. So you can also have it carry things just like this, like how we have Vector. <laughs> how cool is that? So that's a robot helping a robot. Exactly, exactly. All right, so this is the second robot I danced with at CES. And wait, what's that? It's really cute. <laughs> that's nice to meet you. Look at you. Oh, wow, it's actually talking to me. How are you doing today? Uh, yeah, we're okay. Good? <laughs> Oh, look at that! Wait, 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 w
So you can have them do different things like this, I'm seeing, right? Like performances and... Yeah. Actually, we're working with uh, animators, you know, like uh, um, uh, animation yeah, from yeah, character. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, we are designing uh, hundreds of behavior like that, you know. Wow. And how many different expressions do they have or that you have uh, able to program? Actually, the expression depends on what you are doing. So right. basically, an infinity. But uh, as I said, we are working with uh, many uh, different animators to create yeah. hundreds of uh, different expressions. So going, like this one. going forward, like if I were to do, like I do unboxing and product reviews, right? I can have him as my partner and have him introduce the product and do different yeah. things too. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's incredible. Well, sign me up. I got. Uh, <laughs> I will be one of the first. <laughs> And the battery life on these, roughly? Uh, so the target is uh, four hours. Four hours. Okay. Yeah, today we are two, two hours, but uh, we are changing everything on uh, this time. And then you have like a station for it that's going to be? Ultimate? Actually, the robot will pick up an object like this and plug itself, you know? Oh, so hold itself. <laughs> yeah, yeah, wow, exactly. Oh, that's smart. So what is the ultimate goal of this robot? Actually, there is two goals. Uh, one goal is uh, automatic object placement okay. in an hospital, in a hotel, restaurant, something else. So you can say, everybody, I want this page in here. Right. Then the robot, during the night, the robot will do that one. Wow. And the second role is to bring Marvel on the internet. Yeah. You know, I want people being amazed to see a robot doing something uh, on the background and uh, uh, the robot giving smile to people that's about. And I can definitely say you guys are setting the bar high yeah, in terms of the robotics world. Please get any questions, Ooh. comment down below. Otherwise, I'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye.